I wear the mask in order to protect this city. But when faced with a new breed of criminals calling themselves the Pact, the direct approach was met with disaster. I had to don a different mask. As Bruce Wayne, I infiltrated their ranks. The plan was to get in, set the trap, and get out. But the plan failed. Now they're one step closer to their goal, and all I have are questions. What is the Pact really after? Why steal Riddler's body? Friend or foe? Nice place you got here. Did it come with the vermin, or did you add that yourselves? This everyone? Riddler mentioned Harley. Miss Quinn is otherwise occupied. Our crossing the river stinks. We are the entirety of our cabal at the moment. Oh, this gentleman was someone we picked up after Riddler's departure. Bruce Wayne. Bruce, was it? Charmed. Be gentle. This is Mr. Wayne's first foray into the field of felonry. Criminal virgin, huh? I won't hold it against you. Now, Chante. Oh, I didn't know this party was so formal. Enough pleasantries. You have the device. Excellent. Harley said your gems were in her safe. If she fails to return, you can pester John. He knows the code. It's fine. We can start. Oh, well, let's get to... What are we doing? Well, we're going to... extricate the body. Riddler built a secret back door into the security system of his old employer. I need to scan his eyes and then create a retinal key for them. Then I'll use the key to make goggles, and we can open whatever doors he could. Help me lift. This wasn't the original plan. He was supposed to be alive, but... Things change. Get his head in a good position. That's far enough. Dig the plates under his lids. Press the button and scan away. Ugh, that's gross. What the hell did they do to him? And what's with the refrigerator coffin? Why would the agency transport him like this? This doesn't add up, Bruce. Bruce, I'm sorry about Lucius. I'm guessing it wasn't a gas leak or whatever the news said. You're right. Riddler killed him. But it was meant for me. Damn it, Bruce. I'm... This isn't all on you. On to the next. I didn't know what I'd be walking into with this group, but I certainly didn't expect it to involve you. And I know you're no stranger to peril, but you shouldn't be here. So, what gives? I wouldn't exactly say I'm part of the team. Also, the sky is blue. Now you say another obvious thing. This is the game we're playing, right? Whatever your plan was, it must have gone horribly awry for you to end up here like this. You're not the only one with questions. One question. Make it fast. So how far did you get on that motorcycle? You haven't popped up on my radar in a while. Oh, you know, all over. Europe, mostly. Felt good to be as far from here as possible. Have we concluded? Two eyes in the can. Excellent work. Then we can... <gasps> She's back!
Sorry I'm late. Traffic was murder. <laughs> oh, I couldn't stand it. You were there, and, and I was here. I was on my way. Well, I was getting to get on my way. Look, I, I put on shoes. Oh, thanks, Puddin. You would have had a blast if you were with me. Mm. And how about this one? Did you miss me, sugar? Well, John was beside himself. Was? I'd say still is. So I got one question for you. If you missed me so much, why the hell did you let them leave me behind? Since Big Bad Bean's plan almost got one of our most valuable members killed today, we're having a change in management. What the hell? So speak up if there are any objections. We can hash this out in a reasonable manner. Hurry! Oh, this one's actually got some brains. <laughs> Everyone else better be smart, too. You! Ah, ah, ah. You are a means to an end. When this is over, did it occur to any one of you people that the job we just pulled went sideways a little too quick? I think they knew we were coming. Because a little rat told them. They was right to beat up his guy before we left to hit the convoy. He just beat up the wrong one. Since he couldn't deliver, I'm taking over the case. And I'm not gonna let whoever it is stop me from getting what I want. This leak, it almost got me killed. So now, no one moves, no one breathes without my say-so. Cause I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. And whoever it is, is gonna find their inside suddenly all fresco. That make you nervous, Bruce? What do you have to say? Do I look nervous to you? Stop waiting! Excuse me, peanut gallery? You got something to say? Wayne pulled his own out there. Saw it with my own two eyes. I ain't gonna let a good effort go unnoticed. Then, let's get back to work! If anyone else has any issues with the New World Order, my door is always open. Hmm. Lead us to our prize, and all will be forgiven. Wayne, come here a second. Hiya, Bruce. Guess you're clear. For now. Because apparently you're so capable. I got an errand for you. I know just about everything about Riddler's plan. But he kept one card close to his chest. The location of the job. Took the secret to his grave. Now I got his laptop. But look at this. And keep your yap shut. Can't let any of these mooks sense weakness. It's encrypted! It's like he knew not to trust any of us. <laughs> Go figure. This is where you come in. Yeah, crazy, right? So you're gonna help me. Riddler had a beef with his former employers, who were cooking up some very dangerous and super fun stuff at a black site lab somewhere here in Gotham. And what is it we're after, this super fun stuff? You ask a lot of questions, you know that? I've been able to piece together most of his plan, except where the Black Site is. You're gonna find the location. And when you do, maybe you'll get a treat. A sweet, delicious little treat. Well, I'm your guy. What do you need? See, 
I ain't letting this laptop out of my sight until I clear up this mole problem. So, I want you to head over to Riddler's place and do some digging. I might need some help. That place is full of death traps. Take John with you. Just don't get him hurt. That's my job. Road trip? With Bruce? I mean... Actually, I was thinking Catwoman. After all, she knew him. Mm, good points. Take a two. I'll grab some snacks. <laughs> What's that guy's story? Cat lady, are you more of a beef jerky or trumpet-shaped corn bites girl? <laughs> Why am I even asking? <laughs> I'll bring both. Hey, be careful around him. He's smarter than he looks. That's good, because he looks... off. <laughs> Who's ready to hit the road? Who are you gonna tell if you see anything that ain't on the up and up? You, Harley. But don't worry, Bruce is my best friend. He'd never betray me. Oh, sweet, innocent puddin'. Friends have the easiest access to stab you in the back. Now get out of here. I call shotgun. I want that black site location. I can't believe this is where he decided to set up shop. Wasn't like him to slum it. I always thought the abandoned water tower was an odd choice. I mean, the mold risk alone. Why don't you two go that way? Then see if anyone's around. Come on, John. We'll go check the other side. <laughs> Meow. Glad you answered. We need to talk. Listen about the convoy. We couldn't get to you safely. The EMP blast knocked out my ability to communicate with my field agents. Sorry. It obviously wasn't supposed to go down like that. Well, innocent people died because of your no-show. You think I don't know that? Those maniacs butchered my agents. My friends! I can't take losses like this. I need to lean on you even more now, Bruce. You being inside. It's our best hope. Well, now they have Riddler's body. It was cryogenically frozen. By the agency. Bruce, this was a 60-year-old man who went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batman. I have some very interested researchers who wanted to see what kept him ticking. Wait, wait, uh... Punchline wrong. Uh, let me start. With you. It's fine, John. Riddler's eyes. They're a key to a door that lies somewhere in Gotham. And Harley doesn't know the location. She asked me to find it. Stay put for now and maintain your cover at all costs. This is our chance to get ahead of this train. So I say, Doc, I'll have what she's having. <laughs> <laughs> we snooped around. There's a police car nearby, but no officer in sight. And it could really use a wash. Maybe it's just placed there to scare off looters, but either way, we should be careful. Okay, let's find a way in. Just have to get through these boards. Don't worry, I brought my key.
Who's there? Don't move. Wait a minute. I know you. You're Bruce Wayne. Uh, guilty is charged. Want to explain what you're doing out here? This isn't exactly the Heights. Uh, this isn't what it looks like. It looks like you're trying to break into a crime scene. No, oh, oh, okay. Detective... Bullock. Detective Bullock, right. Uh, look, there's... actually a very good reason for all of this. Stay right there, Jerkwad. I'm calling this in. I've been asked to report any suspicious activity around here, and you're acting suspicious. Oh, come on now, Detective. We can work this out, just the two of us. I disagree. Bruce freaking Wayne. Unbelievable. Wouldn't even be working tonight if I didn't need the extra dough. But maybe this will make me look good with the boss. Oh, sure, sure. O overtime, right? Well, maybe... maybe I can help with that? I'm not that kind of cop. No, 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 of course not. Of course not. This... this benefits both of us. Here, here. It's everything I got on me. Just hang up the phone, and it's yours. <laughs> Try not to die in there. I do not want this coming back on me. Come on, let's get moving. a little warmth. Huh, sounds like you knew a very different Riddler than the one I met. I wish he'd never come back to Gotham. Me too. There's hope for everyone. I don't think any of us are beyond reach. <laughs> I know we've just met, but somehow I knew you'd say that. What? You knew him best. Where do you think he'd keep any info on what we're after? Well, not to state the obvious, but... It's probably behind a riddle or a puzzle somewhere. Ooh, I call the downstairs bedroom! <laughs> Careful, John. This place is probably a death trap. Follow him, Bruce. I don't want John's curiosity to get us killed. I'm getting really tempted to touch something! <laughs> How many TVs does one guy need? Probably afraid he'd miss something. Handcart? Wonder what he was moving. he was a killer? Because he was rude to me! We need to stick together. I don't trust this kitten one bit. You know what they say about a black cat crossing your path. You're right, John. I am. Of course I am. <laughs> Watch out, in case she tries to make a move.
gotta admire the ingenuity. It's a wonderful toy. It's a wonderful way to lose your hand. Well, you know what they say. Curiosity killed the cat. There's something under here. Some kind of platform. This is where he built his boxes. Why do you hate Riddler so much? I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me. Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know? Made me look like an idiot in front of Harley and those other guys. But hey, uh, I guess I have the last laugh now. <laughs> John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask, what do you see in Harley? Her ruthlessness. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> Good. I I've been meaning to ask him. The green hair, what, what, is, what is that? I don't know, what's with your black hair? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm a little sensitive about my style. Well, I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to... Well, here it was. I guess it's natural. Let me help you out there, Bruce. I don't want you to bend your cover book. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. Work, sleep, death. A little grim. A little boring is what it is. Tesla coils. This whole place is an electrical death cage. If these start sending out energy, we'll all fry. That's odd. Shh. 
sure proud of his exploits, wasn't he? Hey, Catwoman. Hey, money man. How'd you and Riddler first meet? You know, I do a lot of... freelance work. Let me guess, Riddler wanted a painting from the Louvre? <laughs> Without bragging too much, it was an easy job. Huh. After all, I'd already robbed the place twice. He became a valuable contact when money was tight. I'm just curious if you... Yes? If you missed me. John is right downstairs. Yes or no? Answer the question. <sighs> Fine. Of course I did. But don't read any more into it than that. So why are you really here? I said I'd tell you when we're alone. We're not. I'll tell you later. Riddler's bed couldn't look less comfortable if he tried. Canned food, and lots of it. We can't all get lobster thermidor on a whim. A pair of Riddler's shoes. He didn't exactly have great fashion sense. Well, he did say something about a foot. That sounds positive. I take you by night, by day take you back. None suffer to hand me, but do from my lack. Maybe someone should stay up here. Keep watch. Good point. Let's go, Bruce. Sorry, cat lady. Or maybe you could stay? Oh, no. Harley gave me an assignment, and I mean to fulfill it. Harley's not here. She'll never know. But I... Hey, I thought we were friends. Oh, okay. I'll be on the next one. He 
She's something. Charming and unnerving at the same time. So, now that we have a moment, care to fill me in? Care to tell me the real reason you're doing this? Out with it, Bruce. What's going on? I'm undercover. For yourself? <laughs> Isn't Bruce Wayne kind of always undercover? Or is it the other way around? No, yes, I'm undercover working with a group called the Agency. Partnered up with people, huh? Good to hear you've grown a bit. Sorry if I was a little rattled at the clubhouse back there. Wasn't quite ready to see your face again, but... You look good. Not great or anything, but good. Let it go, Selena. We had a moment a while ago. Oh, okay. Sorry, I... Forget I said anything. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this... Pact. And what if I am? Maybe I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. You're better than that. You keep saying that. You're like a broken record. Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty boring. Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. But we've got a job to do, remember? Let's just see what this is all about. Typical on button. <sighs> Encrypted. Just like the laptop. There must be something nearby we can use. Gotta be a password, right? It's what we came here for. It's at least worth a try. Riddles. <laughs> a little on the nose, don't you think? Didn't Riddler carry one of these in Europe? He did. They were purely aesthetic. USB drive. You think it might be a trap? Maybe, but we already made it past the line of security, so maybe not. Your certainty is assuring. Here we go. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. I haven't made the goggles yet. Retinal scan. Time out. The fastest protocol detected. The decryptor! You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, their group up to... No good is generous. They're scary. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius... This is my fault. 
My mess to clean up. By yourself? I can help. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. Balancing the scales. You are not leaving here with that. Oh, honey. I'm already gone. Resourceful as always. You haven't gotten past me yet. Slow down a bit. You're coming out blurry. Skilled you are with your hands. <laughs> Awfully bold move, considering we just met, Mr. Wayne. This is flirting. Move, John. Harley's laptop for myself, and I'm finishing this my way. <clears throat> Harley's laptop, huh? You and I were going to talk somewhere else. So, John, about the laptop, um... You know, I'm the first guy who'd resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, getting her good graces. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll do just that. Then she'd remember my name has an H in it. She always spells it J-O-N. And how do you think Harley feels about snitches? She told me to snitch. I think she likes them. Well, maybe not. I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great, don't, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one? Uh, 
I guess you could say she's my Harley. I'm not sure she's good for me, but I just can't seem to get away from her. You stop right there, Bruce Wayne. I'm tearing up. Look at this couple of weeping willies over here. <laughs> Drowning our sorrows in caffeine and sugar. <sighs> if only Harley saw me. Like, really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> I see. You're up to bat, then, Wayne. What did you do to make Catwoman purr? How can I get that with Harley? People aren't as complex as you make them out to be. Harley's smart, but she's still human. She can be manipulated just like anyone else. Anyone, huh? How does one go about performing this magic trick? Find a problem they have, and then make sure they think you are the only one who can solve it. Once they have to rely on you, they're yours. <laughs> We're social animals, John. Might as well exploit it. But how do you know what makes them tick? Too bad you can't just open them up and take a look. You just need to talk to them. Just... They'll reveal themselves soon enough. Give them something small about yourself. Something insignificant that maybe they already know, but you act like it's a confession. And then you watch the floodgates open. I see, I see. Yeah, that reminds me. Did I ever tell you I was locked up in a mental hospital? Not too long ago, either. Nice try. I've learned that manipulation can take on many forms. Some of them more subtle than others. Tell me more. Tell me everything. Get inside their head. Once you know how they think, you know what they want. And you use that. You know, one of the doctors in Arkham tried to get in here. Wait, wait. I have an idea. Let's try it out. First thing that comes to your head, what do you see? But don't think, let your gut guide you. I don't know, bats. Ooh, like creatures of the night, do you? You're an interesting case study, Mr. Wayne. I think you might be a danger to yourself and others. <laughs> Is what Dr. Leland would always say to me. <laughs> This one, what do you see? I don't know, it looks like a, like a maze. The alleyways of Gotham. Ah, a complicated path. The way out isn't clear. You ever do the mazes in the back of those activity magazines and doctor's waiting rooms? I have, a ton of them. Been waiting my whole life just to be seen. What an illuminating evening this has been, Bruce. I feel like we're on the verge of a breakthrough. Let's try just one more. John, sorry, something just came up. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? It's, it's fine. A for effort, Bruce. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. So... Will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. We did have a good back and forth with the tests. I feel so much closer. It's nice. Oh, you drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Jeez. Okay, let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. Bruce?
Jim. Nicotine patch. Happy now? <laughs> Don't look so pleased with yourself. Oh, it's good you're here. Last time I fired this up, you didn't show. Had me concerned. What do you mean? The agency convoy? All those freaks were in one place and you decide not to show? Oh, I didn't like you. You don't take time off. So what kept you? I had business elsewhere. That would better have been pretty damn important. Had to notify a lot of families tonight. Too many. I was counting on you. I'm sorry. It's just we took a big hit from those animals. I guess I can't really talk. We got there late. And by then it was just Quinn. She still hospitalized a dozen good cops, then gave us a slip. Is that all? Uh, no. No, I... I got a favor to ask. Lucius Fox. I know he was your friend, and I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. But I think he might have been up to some shady stuff before Riddler's attack on Wayne Tower. He might not have been the man you thought. Not entirely. I knew Lucius Fox for years, Gordon. The man was a saint. On the surface, maybe. There's more to the story. Riddler targeted him for a reason. Waller shut down any investigation into the circumstances surrounding his death. And that means something stinks in Denmark. They could follow that stench all the way to Fox's employer. Look. Just how much do you really know about Bruce Wayne? With all the scandals surrounding his family, it's hard not to be familiar with Bruce Wayne. Yeah, and if you haven't noticed, he's got a knack for burying bad publicity. He had everyone believing he was a stand-up guy, including me. At first, I thought Fox was at the center of it all. But there's a hell of a lot more. A Wayne Enterprises security guard comes to GCPD saying he was assaulted by Harley Quinn and her gang. And who was leading her around like a pet? Bruce Wayne. Then I checked the video recordings. Someone did an amateur job covering up the security footage. Files were replaced, time unaccounted for, sloppy. And strike three? He flashes enough cash at one of my officers to get into Riddler's old workshop. Why? Bruce Wayne is dirty and he's dangerous. Waller knows all of this happened, too, and she refuses to let me move on it. So I need you to bring him in. That's the favor. I can't do it, but you can. If you've got all that, do it yourself. Fine. Maybe I will. God, some safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I know your friend Catwoman's in town. Got a rap sheet that'll put her away for life. Maybe I can't move on Bruce Wayne, but I can move on her. I should have done this a year ago. Please, Jim. Don't. This is between you and me. I thought you were better than this, Batman. As soon as I get back to the office, I'm sending out a task force after her. And you... You better not tell her we're coming. He sounds like he's on a war path. If I warn Selina and she gets away, Gordon and the police will blame me. But if I don't, 
I put her in danger. Don't forget that you're both after that laptop. Gordon might be your best chance to slow her down. Unfortunately, we're running out of time. Damn it. Gordon has gone too far this time. I can't help but have sympathy for a man trying to do what is just. He feels as if Gotham is slipping out of control. And it is. You know, Miss Kyle is going to run sooner or later. It's her nature. How much can you really trust her as an ally? I know how you feel about her. Make certain you aren't letting that cloud your judgment. She already betrayed me back at the workshop. Yes, Catwoman's motives will always be suspect. You know what must be done. It's done, Al. I hope Gordon doesn't take it personally. I'm afraid he will. Don't go, Gordon. I've got a city to save. <laughs> Please, Jim. You have to let me in. I can't. Too much. I'm the best friend you have in spandex or whatever my suit is. You can trust me. What if I grew a mustache for you? Batman! Hi! Hello! So, uh, John. My name's John. John Doe. You don't know me. Well, we actually did cross paths once, but, uh... What did you overhear? I, I didn't hear anything. I just got here, I swear. Oh, this is just... What a pleasure. It's so nice to finally meet you. It's just a handshake. No. Uh-huh. Jeez, this is Arkham all over again. I'm just such a huge fan of yours. And here you are, in the flesh. <laughs> Looking for mentors, role models. I've come across a few good candidates. You're... you're Batman. <laughs> I don't take on students. Now hold on. Before you accept, here's what I bring to the table. I can get you Riddler's laptop. All his secrets right there. And the gang who attacked the convoy, they needed to pull off a big score. The point. So what if... I steal it from Harley Quinn, no less, and give it to you. But, uh, and, and, this, is, and this is a big but. I need you to promise nothing bad will happen to Harley. I mean, letting one criminal slip through the cracks every once in a while can't be the worst thing. That depends on what she does. If she hurts innocence, then I stop her. Wow, well, that's... You really... This is what dedication looks like, huh? Well, if I get the laptop, uh, there is no score, so win-win. Now, now, when you're on the job, what's the preferred method of extracting a target? Always repelling in, or explosives as a distraction, or... You know what? I'll wing it. If I were you, I'd get a friend to help. That's a great idea! I hope Bruce is there. He'd do anything for me. Oh, one last thing! <laughs> if I collect these, they mean a lot to me. What, what the... No pictures. Laptop behind the stack deck. Well, I hope you weren't counting on a specific time, because, you know, that's what I use my phone for.
you speak, but all I hear are lies. You dishonor yourself, Timothy. If you are the rat, then wear it proud. I would have respect for that, and with respect comes mercy. Greetings, Wayne. Come with me. As a fellow apostle of technology, I thought you might appreciate this. Vane and I were acquiring components for a device I'll need once we get to the black site. Device? Yes, an ice explosive for the fire failsafe we anticipate encountering. That isn't the impressive detail. As we ran into interference, I determined I would be more efficient if I made smaller versions and employed them as projectiles. Who were they? Hindrances. As you can see, it's been wildly successful. This is wrong. You're sick. Sick is in the eye of the beholder, Mr. Wayne. I am only dedicated. We live in a twisted world, Bruce. Better to abide than struggle against it in vain. One more time, my friend. Why did an alarm go off when it was your job to ensure it didn't? Bane, come on! I, I slipped up! Dangerous time to make a mistake when you knew I was looking for it more. You're trying to slow us down! No! Look, I want to get paid just like you! I got mouths to feed! Then, when the police arrived, you were nowhere to be found! I... You know I'm no traitor. I stood up for you, remember? Come on, man. We have to stand together on this. Yeah, sure. Pretty bold move. Good, yeah, yeah. Now, now why, why would I do that if I was dirty? I'd have thrown you to the walls to cover my ass, right? Oh, ho, ho. a deft turn. But it's not enough to save you. In fact, your awareness of how to deceive only creates more suspicion. What the hell is going no, on no, here? No, 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 no! Merely plugging their leak. God damn it, Bane. You running your own investigation? You gonna get little business cards printed that say Detective Bane now? <laughs> <laughs>